to left field. Ben Intende over, oh, won't get goodness. there, and Garver delivers. Dozier will score, and Garver gets the first Twins extra base hit to put them in front. <laughs> yeah, I need to go to the casino. Where is it? A two out double for Garver, who drove in five yesterday, and he drives in an awfully big one here tonight. Yeah, he stayed short on that fastball, was able to shoot that thing to left center field. Oh, no, it's all speed hangy. He hangy bangy. He stayed short and saw that pitch into the. It's off his barrel and he crushed it. And now we have another runner in scoring position and we're threatening again. Two and two. In the air left center field well hit by Avi and this ball is an absolute no doubter. Third solo shot for the Sox this afternoon. 11 homers, 23 driven in for Avi, who continues to hit the ball out of the ballpark. Daniel Polka crushes this ball. Right field, another. One more multi home run game for Polka. Suddenly, the great shrinking lead is down to two. Justin Anderson getting loosened up in a hurry as Tropiano has given up back to back bombs here in the seventh. Nicky to right field toward the pole down the line it goes gone. It's a one run game. A boundary tester from Delmonico. That one was a bomb that hit way up on the screen and that is going to be it. That's out toward right field, hit well. Avi Garcia is back. He pulls up. Gone! Big fly for Francisco Garcia, his first big league home run. Oh, perfect timing at the distracted pitcher, worrying about Ian Kinzer at first base. Garcia picks up his first major league hit, a home run. Well out to right field. Congratulations on that one. And all those runs right back with a one swing in the bat. Back to a four-run lead for the Halos. Oh. And it's killed. Is it four games in a row? You can take it to the house. I watched the kid on the mound when the ball left the bat. He looked into Alfaro and just kind of shook his head like, wow. But there have been a lot of pitchers in 2018 after Suarez has come to the plate, they've shaken their heads and said, wow. So the first home run allowed by Suarez and it's all minor leagues of course but Cowboy he had not given up a home run since the 22nd of April one down two on Fenway starting to fill up 0 2 on the way and that's hammered up the middle a dive and a miss by Brock Holt Mauer rounding here comes the throw by Jackie Bradley to the plate the tag he got him he cut him down Mauer out at home JBJ on target for the second out of the inning. Yeah, it looks like Bradley's got his fifth assist of the season. Here's the pitch, and it swung on. He hit hard up the middle by the diving hole to the center. Mauer hits third. He's being waved home. Here comes Jackie's throw to the play, and he is out. What a strike on the fly. Jackie guns him down. Twyhart grabbed the throw, chest high, and slapped the tag on the sliding Mauer. A very close play, but he got him. It took perfect execution to do it so Zach Britton came over from the Orioles he'll be a free agent at the end of the year and he gets his first try on the Yankee Stadium mound oh nice play there by Walker on the short hop to get Moustakis strike three Perez down looking grounded over to Bird to Britain and a Yankee debut of a 1-2-3 inning for Zach Britton. 2-2. 
And that one hits Judge. Couldn't get out of the way, so he'll take first. And out comes Stevie Donahue. So you see this ball just running up and in, but as a hitter, unintentional or not, it hurts. And you see, I thought that got him on the forearm. That's closer to the wrist, which uh, much more painful. Yeah, that's dangerous situation there. Uh, Stevie Donahue, a lot of times, you know, you'll check the strength of the hand to make sure you still have grip and everything. If you want to tell Aaron Judge, squeeze me as hard as you can. <laughs> you, yeah. you might be going to get an X-ray. And Duhar is on deck, and that's where Judge should be. So you wonder he was hit earlier on what it looked like the, the wrist, you know, the meaty part of the hand. Judge, we are told by the Yankees, seen by team physician Dr. Christopher Ahmad, and now we'll go to New York Presbyterian for an MRI. 3-2 pitch. In the air to left field. That ball is crushed. And Reese Hoskins has just given the Phils a 1-0 lead in the first inning of tonight's ball game. In the air to right field. That's well hit. Going back is Irvin, and it is gone. A two-run home run for Santana. And the Phils take a 3-0 lead here in the first. In the air to center field. Billy Hamilton is going back toward the wall. It is gone. Up onto the lawn. A solo home run for Nick Williams. That one is crushed deep to left field. Forget about it. Another home run for the Phils. A solo shot from Michael Franco. And it's now 5 4 Phillies. In the air to left field. Going back on it is Duvall, and it is gone. It's a two homer night for Reese Hoskins, number five for the Phillies. And they lead it 6 4. In the air to left field. Going back is Duvall, and it is gone. Our second two homer game. Reese Hoskins has done it. Now Michael Franco has done it. That one is lined deep to right center field. How about Nick Williams with his second home run of the night? Three different players have hit two home runs in tonight's ball game for the Phils. Williams' second home run ties the franchise record for homers of the game with seven. Machado knows a little something about that. It was a crazy lead up for him through the All-Star break. He leads off this six against Sanchez, and it's a rocket to left center field. Manny Machado's first home run is a Dodger. His 25th of the season, and the Dodgers lead it 3 0. First home run as a Dodger. You know, it was only a matter of time. Now Machado with a fly ball to left field. Well hit on its way, and it's gone. Manny Machado with his first home run as a Dodger on the first pitch of the sixth inning. No doubt about it. The Dodgers take a 3 0 lead. Last chance for the Cubs. They trail by a couple of runs. Now it's David Bodie. There's a drive out of the left center. We are tied. Whoa, baby. Whoa, Bodie. The home run is indeed in play. And David Bodie is having himself one fine afternoon at the ballpark. Singled and scored in the fifth and ties it with a home run in the bottom of the ninth. And the 0-2. Bodie drives one in the air. Deep left center. It's got a chance. Gone. Two-run homer. Ball game tied 6-6. Cubs were down 6-1 to one in the fifth inning. Go ahead, Riz. Go ahead. Go ahead. Ball game over. Cubs win. Cubs win. Oh, my. What a finish. That's the first one in a long time for Anthony Rizzo. <laughs> he is getting mobbed at home plate. The pitch to Anthony. Swung on. Hit in the air. Deep right field. Cubs are going to win the ball game. Anthony Rizzo. A game-winning home run. Listen to this place. Back-to-back -back bombs for the Cubs. Game-winner, Anthony Rizzo.